Hey what is going on guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you another squad builder on FIFA 16. So this team costs about 115k I think on PS4 and about 86k on Xbox One so you know roughly around 100k on both consoles. So starting off in goal I'll jump straight into the squad builder so in goal we have got Buffon the amazing Juventus goalkeeper that's playing absolutely quite incredibly for um, for Italy at the moment in the, in the Euros. This guy is doing amazingly. Um, really good goalkeeper as you can see he's got really good stats 85 diving 83 reflexes uh, 79 handling 89 positioning and overall you know really good well-rounded stats and very solid goalkeeper you know for his price and that's my center backs two of my favorite players in the game this defense is absolutely incredible guys and um, definitely definitely a defenders you should try out all of these guys and um, but yeah on the right hand side as you can see Chiellini really great player I like to use him in a lot of my squad builds just because of how solid he is and then as for my left centre back I've got I've gone with Imtiti uh, I'm not really sure how you pronounce his name to be honest but um, as you can see this is team of the season card and this guy is absolutely incredible as you can see from his stats he's got such nice rounded stats for for a, um, an 85 rated player as you can see 80 pace 80 dribbling 88 defending 87 physical and 75 passing for a centre back He's got very nice rounded stats, as you can see. His lowest stat is 67, which is shooting. And to be honest, 67 shooting on a on a centre back is absolutely amazing. Um, and overall, this guy is just an absolute beast at the back. Plays so well alongside Chiellini. And overall, two of my favourite centre backs um, in FIFA 16. I think they work so well together, and um, very very solid players. As for my right back. I like to use Lichtsteiner, the player that gets a nice link up with uh, Chiellini here, because they both both play for Juventus, um, the Switzerland right back. This guy, and again, another incredible player, 83 pace, 75 dribbling, 80 defending, 79 physical, and 72 passing. So really nice, well-rounded stats, as you can see again. Uh, high, high work rate, so he's up and down that right-hand side, and um, overall, an absolute beast of a player. And on the left-hand side, I've got another team of the season player to get that nice link up with uh, Umtiti which is Sidibe. This guy is absolutely incredible you know 81 pace, 78 dribbling, 85 defending, 81 physical and 80 passing. Again another player, um, all these defenders you know they have really nice well-rounded stats to be honest and um, another player Sidibe there. Uh, his passing is great with the 80 passing. He's got high medium work rates uh, which you know means he'll get forward a little bit more than some people may like. But um, if you just stick a player instruction on him, like stay back while attacking, and uh, he'll stay back and help out the defence most of the time. As for my left centre defensive midfielder, I've gone with Diara. Um, this guy is an absolute beast, you know. I've gone with his upgraded card because it's not that, it's not too much coins. And um, he's an absolutely amazing player, definitely try him out. As you can see, he's got really nice well-rounded stats, 77, part, uh, 77 pace, sorry, 76 dribbling, 81 defending, 71 physical and 72 passing. And overall, this guy is very good in that CDM role. He likes to stay back a little bit more with that medium high work rate and does a great job, you know, just protecting that back four. Uh, plays very well alongside Kadira, which is another Juventus player which I use. Um, I think my whole right side is from Juventus, actually, just because I really like these um, Juventus players. To be honest, they're one of the best teams to use on FIFA 16 Ultimate Team, I think. They've got such good players, um, such overpowered players. But as for Kadira, as you can see, he's not quite as fast as Diawa, but his defending and physical stats are basically as good as a centre-back. You know, it's like sticking a, a huge centre-back in that CDM role and just letting them protect the back four alongside Diawa, which works very well, you know. You've got the pace of Diawa on that left-hand side, and then you've got the um, the height and the strength of Kadira playing alongside him. And overall, it works very nicely together, and um, they keep your defence very solid. And um, as for the defence, you know, that's probably one of the de best defences I've actually used on FIFA 16, to be honest, in my opinion. It's so solid, you're going to concede very few goals with them. And um, with these two guys sitting in front of them, you're, you're going to be very solid, you know, even in the higher divisions like Division 2 and Division 1. They're going to do very well for you. And moving on to my cams, I have got Pereira on that um, right-hand side. Of course, I've got him, you know, another Juventus player. Can't leave this guy out of the team. Um, an absolutely amazing player. I mean, if you look at his all-round stats, 85 pace, 85 dribbling, so he's really, really quick. 71 shooting. I'd say his shooting feels a load better than that, to be honest, in my opinion. 81 passing, 74 defending, and 75 physical. So even his defending and physical stats are great. You know, he'd work that CDM ball very well um, if you put him there. But he's got that high, high work rate, so he's up and down the pitch, which works very well. You know, as a cam on the right-hand side in this formation, he does like to get wide a little bit sometimes. But you know that works very well with that with that pace that he's got. Um, he can sort of beat players going down the line, 
or even cut inside and uh, find a cross or, or have a shot. And overall, an absolutely amazing player. As for the left-hand side, my cam over here is Di Maria. Is, um, I think this is his original cam card. Yeah, as you can see, for PSG. Another great player, you know, 88 pace, 86 dribbling, 79 shooting, 83 passing and 70 physical. So another brilliant player, you know, similar to Pereira. He's very quick. Um, obviously, his defending physical stats aren't quite as good. But, um, you know, he can stay wide a little bit, this guy, and he'll beat players down the wings, or he can cut inside. And with that right foot, 79 shooting, he's going to find the back of the net a lot from the edge of the box. He also got 83 passing as well, as you can see, so he can find those strikers very well. Then as for my strikers, on the left-hand side, uh, one of the most overpowered players on FIFA 16, and this guy is just an absolute beast for his price, is Lacazette. Um, I've tried using this guy's inform cards, but to be honest, for some reason, I found that just his normal gold card has got me so many more goals than his informs, which is kind of weird. Uh, I found that a few, with a few cards on FIFA 16. I've just found his normal uh, rare gold card has performed the best for me, to be honest, uh, this year, which is very strange. I'm not sure wh why, to be honest, um, but he's got me the most goals. And as you can see with those stats, you can understand why. He's got 88 pace, 85 dribbling, 85 shooting. 74 passing and 73 physical which is absolutely incredible for an 84 weighted player and he's only like 3 three or 4k I think this guy which is just astonishing I don't know how he's so cheap um, but definitely put this guy in this team um, if you haven't tried him on FIFA 16 already and then to finish off the team on the right hand side to playing alongside him I've got Morata um, he sort of adds a bit of height to the uh, to the attack you know He's a bit of an outlet to head to hit the ball to if you want to play like Route 1 at all and get those flick-ons to Lacazette. Uh, it works very well to be honest. I think this guy's about 6 foot 1, 6 foot 2 so he's pretty tall. Um, he feels a lot stronger than 73 physical to be honest with that height that he's got. Um, he's also pretty quick you know if you put this guy through on goal he's gonna hold he's gonna hold his own going forward. Um, he's a definitely a hard player to get off the ball and um, his shots are just amazing. He feels a load better than 81 shooting in my opinion. And um, overall, an absolute beast of a team. Definitely worth 100k. Um, I'd probably pay 200k if this team cost that much, to be honest, because of how good it is. Definitely try it out if you have the coins. So yeah, that's today's video, guys. Remember to leave a like and subscribe if you're new around here. And I will see you in the next video.